because when you're married, those places are still available. It's not like it closes. I'm not getting married because I'm tired of Pretoria. Yeah. I'm getting married. <laughs> like, whoa. <laughs> whoa. <laughs> the title. Podcast and chill. Matt G, the ghost lady, and Len Moleko. Okay, next question to Len. Is he still getting married this year? What we are shada. What is marriage? Yeah, eh. Something that you're not doing? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, clearly. But what is marriage? Clearly. That's not an answer. Uh, who have you? Uh, I, were you were you were you humanizing that? Mm-hmm. Okay, I thought you it's were. It's not seven or two. Mm. Okay, cool. So we are shada this year. I'm doing the right thing this year. As in, uh, marriage is different to other to from exactly. different so, folks. Hey. Listen, listen, who started yeah. selling? Hey, straight selling. to the point. So, hey, please, hey, straight to the point. No, but are I'm you being getting married this year? When you say marriage, marriage mm-hmm. is. Am I gonna go and accept oh, the bride gosh, and whatever? Oh, of course gosh, I will. Oh. I am. Oh, okay. But am I gonna have a white wedding where MacGyver is not even gonna be the best man? <laughs> no. Oh, okay. So we are lobola this year. That's what you say. <laughs> <laughs> and that's a wrong thing to say. Because <laughs> I feel in black culture, when you lobola and you do the things, mm-hmm. that's marriage. Okay. The white wedding and whatever, those are just. Optics. So, are you sending Bola Malume this year? They are ready, Chief. Or you are sending them this year? They they are ready. They've got a date. Oh, beautiful. Nizwile, guys. Hmm? On podcast news. <laughs> With Ghost Lady. <laughs> With Ghost Lady. Boom. You never saw it coming. <laughs> Thank you. So, you're off the market, Chief. Mm, mm, mm. Yeah? You're off the market. <laughs> ah, market is a market. <laughs> A market is a market. If you are in a market, <laughs> I, I can tell you for free. Mm. As much as uh, we're not going to have a sports show, there's no wedding. <laughs> uh, well, no, there's not going to be a wedding. Mm. But the right things will be done. No, but you heard it. Eh? Let's, for, don't, let's not label this thing. All we just know is that Abo Malume. The right things will be done. Uh, and you believe that goes late. The Abo Malume are going to You believe that. Yeah. F- from him. I believe it. Mm. Mm. You know what's funny, ne? From Len to God's ears. <laughs> no, not even from Len to God's ears. <laughs> uh, I met with them earlier on, or oh, late December. Oh. Ooh. I met with them the family. early January. Yes. Okay. You said Rasmun. And then we had discussions and whatever and whatever. Mm-hmm. So there's a cousin of mine mm. who just happened to be ahead of me because <laughs> my dad's side of... No, his woman is pregnant. Oh. So... My dad's side of the family, because mm-hmm. I need representatives from him, mm. or from that side of oh, the family. Oh, so they are booked, oh. Karen. So they are booked <laughs> <laughs> ahead of me. <laughs> so I just happen to book a later date. Oh, yes. okay. I, know, I hear all, your problems. That, those are just the semantics that are there. No, oh, okay. So it's not like Corona. What makes you think you're ready for marriage? because of What makes you think you're ready for marriage? Because I've been through the trenches, Chief. Hmm. So I've, you I've, you've I've, been used and abused. Now you feel no, like yeah. No, I was not used. Ghost lady, you married. Yeah, but do you think who's ready to get married between me and Lynn? It's got nothing to do with me. Ah, ah. This is what inner ngapagati. You see, when a man talks like Len and says he has a finally wants to call the malumes, it's just a responsibility. What do you mean call them? We these discussions are done, guys. Yeah, thank you. Be no, precise, Ghost no. lady. Who do you think is ready to get married between the two of us? Well, the person who has. Uh, communicate with Boma Lum and they've put a date and they are ready for marriage. Okay. Yeah. So, so Len, Len, Len is in married. other words. Yeah. When I have you. Does he even know his Malumes? <laughs> <laughs> Does your family know that you are dating? <laughs> <laughs> Should we call your mom? <laughs> Let's call your mom live. <laughs> she probably think MacGyver is still a virgin. <laughs> nah, I don't know. Yeah. She knows I'm not. Okay. So, you are ready, Chief? Ready for what? Marriage. I was never ready to work. I was never ready to... You can't compare marriage and work. No, they're both commitments, actually. Mm. Okay. I feel like Ghost Lady is a married person. You should be helping me out here, but... How should I help you out? No, but you can't approach... Your question was, who's ready? And I'm saying, I'm just using practical... question is, you can't approach... You can't approach marriage like... You go into a gig. It's not the same thing. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, so marriage is like a... Doors open. <laughs> a 10 o'clock for free. 
no, first hundred no. ladies are free. Ladies are free. <laughs> <laughs> well, actually, in that one, I think it is. <laughs> More married niggas get pussy than niggas who are single. <laughs> oh, is that why you're getting married? <laughs> mm. No, actually. Okay. No, when, actually. when did you decide? I'm okay. tired of the game. Oh. Are you the kind of man you do you look forward to wearing a ring? I actually want to tattoo my ring. Hmm. I'm tired of the game. Okay. The game is tiring. All right. Okay, so wait till next weekend. No, man, that's, oh, that's tiring. That's, that's, the, that's a wrong way to view it. No, no, no. Because I'm when you're get, married, no, no, those I'm places not, no, no. are still available. It's not like it closes. I'm not getting married because I'm tired of Pretoria. Yeah. I'm getting married. <laughs> <laughs> like, whoa. <laughs> whoa. <laughs> you tired of him? Even, even Tabak, same group. <laughs> same with them. Like, what happened? <laughs> no. <laughs> listen, no, no, you got lost. You got no, kidnapped. No, listen. No, 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 no. I've never been kidnapped. Kidnapped. I'm, I'm tired of... I'm tired of the game. Uh... When your eggs are in different baskets, you'll never know which one is broken and which one is still intact. Mm. I'm a precise person. I want to know what entails what entails me. Mm. I want to die and mm. I don't have drama. There's a woman you know, that's the only woman that's going to yes, cry for you. I, I, I don't want my, my, my mother and my family to be embarrassed at the gravesite. And this Where there's some snake queen who's throwing a weave inside the, 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 the <laughs> thing. No, I don't want mm. that. Um, I want to be a person who is a person to a person who we can enjoy life together. Because I'm of the belief that I come from where a my mom... A school of... No, no, no. A school of my mother and my father got married. Mm-hmm. Ne? And my father and my mother said, till death do us apart. Part. And death did do them apart. Uh-huh. And even in death, my mother sees no interest in being with another person. Being with another person. Okay, like let's say you were to die and now your fiancé or your wife I'm dead. D- decides to have... Are you now going to feel like, whoa? But I'm dead. Okay. But I've got a red flag. At no point during your whole tirade... Which tirade? <laughs> the one you just said now. Did you ever mention you love you want to get married because you love your partner? You can you can never get into a relationship and a commitment like that if love is not involved. Oh, you mm. can. That's a base. That's, oh, you that's, can. That's, that's that's a that's a that's a for me. I feel for me for me that is. It's it's a semantic. The thing is, Len, I've seen a lot of couples, guys get married because of they were able to. It's like this stuff I'm trying to please you. So you, you, you fall in love with a girl, right? And what she says, because obviously at that point as a man, you're thinking, I can do, I'll do anything. I'll do anything to please her, mm. right? Anything for you. Is it 3T, ne? And she says, oh. I'll just record. Yeah, it's yeah. 3T. I will do and she, anything. And she says, okay, I want to get married. I want to be a wife. And this is what I want to have children. And the guy, because he's able, he's thinking, oh, okay, well, how much is it to get married? Oh, okay, so maybe they, at your house they want 50,000 lobola who do a wedding, 200,000. Okay, sharp, get married. And then you realize that you've not thought of, actually, it's not that you are loving the person. You were just in, just attracted. And mm-hmm. therefore, you end up doing this whole process, this marriage process, because it was financially, you were financially able to do it. Mm-hmm. Love was never involved. It was just literally lust. Mm-hmm. So that happens as well. True, mm-hmm. but uh, I'm, I'm, I'm homies with my person. No. We're friends more than anything. That's good. And I think that's what makes you us lacking, what just want to hear you say. Oh, mm. yeah. Because I'm hearing, I'm tired of the I'm game. Tired, I'm tired. I'm tired. I want this. Because I, I wouldn't, want I would, oh, but those I, I'm not a bed, but, like but as a again, woman. Like, I'm just because you're tired of being. <laughs> now, I'm shut up because you're tired of being. I'm tired of sick? Victoria. <laughs> <laughs> like, so, <laughs> let me try it. Let's move to Cape Town. <laughs> no, no. Listen, yeah. What I'm saying is, if you look at it, ne, there are so many little. Things, uh, I'm gonna call them things because of a lack of a better word. In that, uh, how chi da, uh, if you work too much, uh, there are so many other variables that happen in in marriages. I'm not married, I'm not gonna speak for married people, but I am amongst a lot of married people or people who were previously married. 
who are oh, going through asked, divorce. Have you seen, have you hanged out with people who are actually divorced and going through divorce? And has that, does that deter week- you from getting married? I see them on a weekly and they don't deter me. Okay, good. Because on the highway, if you're driving a Ferrari and I'm driving a Hyundai, your experience and my experience on the highway is not the same. Good belief. All right. On that note, talking about marriage, like someone actually asked and made a question for, well, sent a question in for Ghost Lady, and they said, does she believe in honeymoon phase or is it just a period for people to lie so that you fall for them? Oh, that's a good question. What are her thoughts? Mm, what are your thoughts, Ghost Lady? I do believe in honeymoon phase mm-hmm. because cause obviously this question is coming from asking. Is, 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 is that a chick? I wouldn't know. <laughs> I don't know how you save people, eh? <laughs> hey, exposing but, me. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah. You eyes area code. <laughs> I've got. <laughs> I've got <laughs> codes. codes. But anyway, no, I've got codes in different area codes. Yeah, but, yes. yeah, but, yeah, but just like that. Pretoria being one of them. O one two six o three. O one one o one one. Hey, what's for Poch? Hey, that that, oh, that shit will kill me for days. I'm getting married because I'm tired <laughs> of, <laughs> of Pretoria. Hey, hey man, go because me na ngum pete wako. Uzo resta like me. I've actually only ever dated one girl from Pretoria. On <laughs> only Hell one no. girl. Hey, but that was funny, dog. That had me yo. Anyway, okay. Mm. But I love the capital. I definitely do believe in um, honeymoon phases, and that's happened. And for me. The most what I've learned about marriage, it's got, it's literally about phases. There's a period where you guys will be lovey-dovey. There's a period where you are actually become more like friends. There's a period where you're more like business partners. So, yes, that honeymoon phase will happen. And just because you are not kissing as much doesn't mean that the love has. It's, the thing is, what marriage for me is, it's understanding. What's the time frame of the honeymoon phase? It, it differs. So for some people, it can last for a whole year. For some people, it's literally mm, a day. Mm. They get married on Saturday. They I wake up tomorrow. Sunday. The honeymoon period is even finished. There's not, there's not even a honeymoon I period. I hate MacGyver 80% of the time. Mm-hmm. I love him 100% of the time. But I hate him 80% of the time because he's annoying. Mm. So our honeymoon phase is over. <laughs> Well, I didn't know I you guys have, were that deep. I don't have a honeymoon. <laughs> make it personal about you two. I don't have a honeymoon phase. This is about ma- wait, no, man, no, so wait. Where, where this is I was about go- a marriage where, thing. Where I was going is, mm-hmm. ne, um, this person. Okay, let me ho- hold up. Hold friendships up. don't have. No, let us let no, us speak. Let let's, speak. Let's, let's, let's hold up because this person. I just want to finish this question, ne, because this person is, is saying that is it this honeymoon phase or is it that people lie so that you fall for them? Yeah. Now. The thing is, when you are falling for someone, you need to also be clever enough to see through all that facade. So I think this is where it comes in. All that facade that, yes, you might be charming me. There, you are there opening my door. You are doing all yeah, of this Yeah, but you don't know if it's a facade lovey. until such certain but time. But you're able to, 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 to see minor mistakes. So if we're going out, mm. how you interact with other people. Oh, yes. So already that says a lot. You may be, oh, sweetheart, baby, my sugar, what, what, But you what, treat what. people like shit. But the waiter, the way you say it, it's, it's, so already you see some signs that some people just block too much Mara, when you, are, and you must ask like real deeper questions got you matter when you are when you are, when you are when you are when you are taken you are more inclined to focus on the person than everything else around them oh true mm-hmm. yeah and i think that's where people get it wrong. yes that's during, they, they during, during it the honeymoon phase yeah. nothing, nothing else matters, matters. Exactly. the person matters yeah that's, so what I, i've i've gone through honeymoon phases mm-hmm. uh, plenty <laughs> you talk for him not hey. really actually <laughs> where's your son <laughs> well that's how he came about <laughs> I don't like you I don't like you <laughs> look at you being serious <laughs> look at you come out of your honeymoon face <laughs> uh, I think apologies for that by no, the way no no I'm kidding I'm kidding um, I think we we, we, we we tend to become when you find comfort because of many disappointments that you've had or when mm. you have never actually had it right, mm. you get to that point and you feel like you've hit it right. Mm. Ne? 
and not hit it right in the sense of hitting <laughs> it right, but hitting it right like, yo, this person gets me. They bring me chocolates, they bring me flowers at the office and whatever. They pick me up, we go to movies, we go to this, picnic, we hike, what, 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 what. What you see versus what his intentions or her intentions are, are two completely different things. Yep. And until those things are intertwined mm, and yep. they are the same thing. Thank yeah. You. You killed it. Nailed ooh, it. Ooh, ooh. Corona. Don't touch. Corona. <laughs> ah, no, this, I can die with you. <laughs> <laughs> I'll die with you. Until those two yeah. are intertwined. Yeah. Then you guys are walking the same path. Thank you. And it's crazy how time reveals everything. You know, like Penny said, time really does reveal anything. Because Definitely. I think in any relationship, we all go there mm. with our own intentions, mm. whether good or bad. But time reveals and then... When you find out the real person, I think that's when the honeymoon phases exactly. ends. Exactly, and, and you're able to that. accept that hu- person for who they are. Yeah. Like, yeah. yeah. Then, then, then you continue. Then you continue. For example, ne, if I meet Ntabi Singh, Ntabi Singh, mm. ne, and Ntabi Singh, sure you wanna use that name? <laughs> oh shit, she's my neighbor. <laughs> uh, next name, next name, I meet Lera. Petunia, Petunia, yeah, mm. Mavis, Mavis, mm. or hey, if I meet Beatrix. <laughs> <laughs> and Beatrix is beautiful. Those are all my maids, eh? <laughs> but it's easier she to swallow. She cleans very well. <laughs> um, I meet Beatrix. You guys are foul. Not not maid, she, she's your helper. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. I meet Beatrix. Beatrix is cool. Upagile. But hmm. Beatrix, oh, yes, with a lot of guys, some things as stupid as a girl Upagile. Mm. Actually gets them going, mm. right? Opakilo, opakilo, opakilo. The sex is good. Your friends love her. They Let like, you start hey. a feminist group, eh? Yeah. Which is obviously foul language to have amongst guys, which we do, but it's foul. Uh, and then you find out, or again, this is where the feminist will come out and be like, ah, um, or on tabi saying, hore. Ah, baby, kupa ung aine lehembe. Translation, iron my shirt. My mm-hmm. shirt. Not iron my hemp as in like prepare my weed, no. Um, iron my shirt. And then I chase her or she doesn't know how to iron. Or you get to the office and people are like, dude, were you being chewed by a fucking cow before you came to work? And then you go back and you think, okay, cool, the sex is good, Mari, like everything else. Because we are... What's the word? We are programmed different ways. There are different... Like, my mother would be like... Isn't the problem there is that the fact that here you are, you can't iron a whole shirt on your own. No, you can. <laughs> <laughs> That's the problem. No, but you can. Fact that you think that no, it's entirely but, but here's the thing. No. Here's the thing. <laughs> you it's can. you. No, no, no. It's not that. I was you can. Can. <laughs> but, you, but you can. You can. Okay. You can. I don't yeah. dispute that you can. All right. You see, uh, I think it was... How do we go from honeymoon to hanging <laughs> shirts, guys? <laughs> to, to what Meg was saying earlier on, before we started recording, ne? there's, I think, four generations of people. Mm-hmm. Ne? There's our grand grandparents who did things a certain way. Mm-hmm. And there were our grandparents who did things a certain way. Mm-hmm. And there were our parents who did things a certain way. Mm-hmm. And there was our mothers who did things a certain way, actually five. And then there was us who did things a certain way, mm-hmm. actually six. And then there's the 2002 are doing things a certain way. Yeah. And what they do, we look at them and be like, what? They look at us and think like, what? So essentially, it's a case of my mother, your grandmother, whoever, whoever, if you have a wife or you have a husband and they don't do what is predominantly assumed to be the duty of that individual, when that is not done, they will look at you like you are the coronavirus. However, a 2000 will be like, oh, yeah, but okay, yeah, but they're not supposed to do that. Mm-hmm. Next question, goes lady. <laughs> What's the next question? Yeah, the, the, the next question. So if your wife does not end for you, you could feel some type of way, but she could feel some type of way between being her being 21, 25, 28, 35, and also based on how strong her feminist radar I'll is. I'll tell you something. As a wife, I don't do ironing. 
No. You've got to help her. Yes, I do. Yeah, but there you, are you times when her. my husband just goes and irons for himself. But like I'm not good at washing yeah. and ironing is not my forte. Yeah. Do you iron? I don't. Do you wash? No, I can't. The washing and ironing is not my clothes. Forte. You mean? Clothes, everything. I just me and dealing with clothes. It's not my. Okay, thing. but that's why you have a helper. You've got yes, means. Yes, I have a helper. But so in the event my helper is not around, my husband does it on his. So on, if, by you rands, <laughs> if you were fifty thousand rands, honeymoon phase over. If you if you were fifty thousand rands, no lesser, honeymoon phase was when he used to iron for me. <laughs> <laughs> and also, it dip, it differs from people to people. Mm. There are I know people who say dating a vendor man is an extreme sport because <laughs> they are very dead set on. Believes on some gain daughter type of thing. Mm-hmm. I'm a vendor man. Yeah. I'm not going to cook my own pap. I'm not it just gonna... depends who they are with. Who can Again. break that? It's on a woman. Um, so, <laughs> it differs from people to people. Mm. Our honeymoon is over, Chief. Your honeymoon. <laughs> you know me and you. <laughs> Clearly, mine is over too. <laughs> Next question. All right. We can't be talking about ironing for 30 minutes, you, guys. Oh, Come on. Okay, but okay. we're ironing out fakes here. <laughs> <laughs> but we got stuck on clothes. That's the problem. Okay. There's a long list of questions here. Okay. Yes. What made McGee suddenly call his baby mama his girlfriend? Because Len called me out and he said I shouldn't call her baby mama. Oh. So you called him out on the side? No. No, no. On, on the, the pod. pod. On the pod? Mm. Yeah. Oh, and you listened? Yeah. Wow. I listened. You see? No, I think... Then the honeymoon no, phase is no, still... No, 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 no. The honey, your, your guy's honeymoon phase is still on. No, I <laughs> you think... You listened to each he other. He was not oh. listening for the first time because honeymoon was over. Okay. And then he listened when the honeymoon was reinvigorated. Okay, then there's another question about Lena, you and proposing. So you've already said, yeah, uh, tumelo malume this year, so... No, I didn't tell him. He's ready. I just have to give him a date. Oh, okay. I need to... Glungi, glungi, the seavum. Seavum. Oh, what must I say? Togoza, watch what? Radumela. Radumela. I'm so to... We're not vooming anything. Gale boha. Okay. Uh, how old is Ghost Lady? How many kids does she have? Jesus. How did how did she meet Habi? And how did she know he was the one? Oh, good question. I'm Ooh. here for that. This is the content I signed up for. Yo. <laughs> <laughs> I'm aligning with Hem, your brand right Hemda. now. <laughs> yeah, Hemda. 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 Let's hear this. I want to hear this. Okay. Um, I am a lovely 32-year-old lady, girl. You're 32, Ghost Lady? Yeah. Me and you are on the same You're an 87, team. baby. Yes, I'm an 87. Yeah. You have kids. Wow. Yeah. I saw the sun before you, Lord. I thought you were like 27. I know, because I'm like, I'm all cute and young little little girl, you know. Hey. Okay. I and how many? Age. I only have one kid. Just the one, one son, five-year-old boy, sweetheart, who doesn't bother the team. <laughs> <laughs> He's one kid that is not a problem, you know. Mm. He could be sitting here just like your son. Eh? Yeah. 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 They are they are those those types. Yeah. And how did she meet Hubby? I met Hubby at church. Weird enough. And Servum. Yeah. No, in my not time. In you don't say that in church. Oh, what yeah. do you say? Amen. amen. Oh amen. So amen. Sangena, <laughs> <laughs> sangena. <laughs> Type thing. Yeah. Singing you wrong, know? wrong songs here. <laughs> you coronavirus. <laughs> That's you the problem. Yes, Chaba. Okay. Who did you go to church with? The hubby. No, with the hubby. Okay, I'd been it's like a church we grew up in, like from when it, when I moved here, this side to Pretoria, right? And Pretoria, a lot of shit is going on. I was down. adamant. See, that's why I, I want to leave. No, <laughs> no, guys, like I was adamant that I do not ch- date church guys. Okay. Like obviously, I was like doing Did my. Do you think thing. they're boring? Of course, boring guys, and well, my hubby is. Uh, he's not. He's not the most exciting. So you didn't leaders. go to church with him. You saw him there. No, we, I go. I went to church with him. So in the like same car. Car. In the same car. Uh. No, like taxi, car, no. bus. Couch, I could just meet there. Oh, you met oh. there. Yeah. You met so there's team. some activities at church that were happening and obviously we'd know, like, you know, let's say... You holy communion the, type of thing. No, not holy oh. communion. Like there's like activities. Oh, like, no, Jesus Lilo. Mm-mm. Like oh. you get the youth, like oh. yes. youth outings, yes. you get the watch what people who are married. They have. I their love how your voice watch-watch. changes when you speak about the things that you guys did that made you meet. But yeah. carry on. Okay. <laughs> but nonetheless, I see without exposing too much. Mm. So we met there, and I was like, hmm. 
And I was doing that in the... the who saw who ah, first? I'm a chief. Can you let her finish, bruh? <laughs> but he's, he's asking a relevant okay, question. Hey, can you let her finish? a relevant question. This is so intriguing.